All right, hello everybody, this is 2248 Aaron. And a while ago, I uh, made a video using this exact same uh, help phone. It is made by uh, EMS. I'm sure it says it somewhere on here. Um, maybe not, but there's a manufacturing date if you're, if you're so interested, EMS right there. Um, and I made just a kind of a crude demonstration video of it. But I'd like to uh, maybe... Uh, make a little bit better of one since I now have a more controlled environment at least with uh, the telephone system and I'm going to show that to you before I start so first here is the EMS phone right here nothing special I guess I'll try and get it open there we go. Um, so there's here's the inter interior of it um, speaker port there's the where the telephone's plugged into I guess it can plug into either or I really don't know what the difference is um, there's a uh, ringer which for some reason doesn't seem to be working maybe you have to that's something you actually have to turn on and yeah so uh and uh and there's the uh the programming information basic programming information not going to get you by how to do advanced things but really, if you're going to be doing any more advanced programming then you uh probably want to use the manual anyways this is not easy to do with one hand i must tell you all right, so it's mostly put together now. Uh, mostly <laughs> is the key word, but it's it's put together relatively decently. Now, um, last time I actually had it hooked up to our home telephone system. Uh, that was just as basic as you could probably go. But this time I uh, I certainly did a little better. Um, as you can see, I have it running to um, this box right here. Um, I'm sure you remember my video I made of these. Um, I, I, I made something of the like of a video a while ago of my uh, VOIP phone system. This is one of them. Of course, there's another one sitting on the floor in there. But, so yeah, this is uh, ready to go. I'm not sure why it just restarted itself. I guess I want to give it a couple minutes to, uh, well, should be good to go. So we had a bit of false starts there, but now everything should be uh, good to go. It's kind of messy. Um, and it's connected to that wireless bridge right there. Um, yeah, so uh, right here I have a Cisco phone. This is actually 7945. That is a has a uh, color LCD screen. That's a uh, picture that I took. But anyway, so um, so we're gonna have this to uh, communicate between that. And I have this set to call that extension, which is 2003, and the extension of this and it fell apart again. <laughs> is two two. Oh, it's calling it. We don't want it to call yet. This is two 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 two. But anyway, so um, what I'm going to try and do, um, since it will be kind of difficult to make, place two different phone calls, well, the phone call to the same thing in relatively short uh, distance, I'll try to put one of these, probably this, in the closet, and uh, as long with me in there, so uh, there can be as little bit of noise as possible. Um, yeah, so uh, first we're going to... We're gonna do a bit of a demonstration. So uh, I'm gonna press the button. And before I start, there's something wrong with this speaker. I really don't know what it is. Um, I guess I could try and get um, a uh, different speaker and see if that remedies the problem. Because I think there's something wrong with this speaker in specific. And which, by the way, I actually brought the tripod out for this. So that means this is gonna be a good video. All right, so that's now a little bit better. Um, I guess uh, it's, well, I'll be a little, uh, crooked because, uh, like I said, this is a, not a very expensive tripod. So, anyways, let's go and press the call button. You tell there's definitely something wrong with the speaker. And uh, uh, perfect. There we go. See, it's definitely calling. So we're going to press answer. Tone, press one to talk. Press two for location. I'll let you do it again. Elevator call. At the tone, press 1 to talk. Press 2 for location. Pressing 2, um... Elevator call. Elevator emergency. 600 pension. Press 0 to alert passenger of rescue. I'm not going to do that because, um... It will make it difficult to hang up the, the phone, the ADA phone. So I'm not going to press 0, but I'm sure you get the idea of what that will do. Um... Anyways, turn that down. Um, so let me turn this lamp off. So the, the light is most definitely on. 
and it is uh, communicating with uh, my phone over there. Um, the strange thing is I can't figure out how to change the, uh, the location. Um, and by the way, whoever set the location didn't do it right because they uh, it, it cuts you off when you uh, listen to it. it says elevator emerges to 600 pen and then it cuts off. I guess that's good because uh, in the event that I don't want anybody knowing where uh, this phone came from, but it was from somewhere in Washington, D.C. I'll, I'll put it that way. Anyhow, so um, let's go and put it off uh, mute. Hello, 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 can you hear me? Obviously you can hear me, but you can't hear me that well. Because there's something wrong with this uh, speaker on this. No, it's just going to ask for the feedback. Now, uh, what I'm now going to do is I'm going to play uh, the whole, the pressing hold, which will, um, it, it's going to play the Sonic, uh, what is it, the special stage music, because that's just what I have as the, uh, I would hope that's uh, is, is non, is, uh, not copyrighted as you can get. So I'm going to press hold on the phone. It sounds pretty normal, actually, but... Certainly not that loud. But that's with, um... That's actually with having a uh, 9-volt battery in there, because uh, they do recommend having a 9-volt battery in there. And, of course, uh, I want to make sure everything it's gonna, going to work. And now what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to uh, transfer this to a phone number that I have. I don't know why it just popped. Um, I'm going to transfer this to a phone number that I have that plays uh, Coldplay, a head, full of uh, a head Full of Dreams, including the beginning sequence of the music video. Oh, why did it just come off? That's really weird. Maybe it has a, maybe it has a limit. Um, yeah, because it's certainly uh, cut off over here. Oops. Um... But I'm going to play a small snippet of that. It includes the uh, beginning part of the music video, which has some guy talking. Actually, yeah, that actually has some pretty important words. In it. So if I were you, I'd definitely listen to it. But I'm going to call back. And this ringtone, by the way, is actually custom. I think it's kind of groovy. Let's see here. I'm going to transfer it. See if it'll do it, or it just won't do it, and it'll uh, make me look like something special. And it just looks like it's not doing it. Just, just to, oh, nope, it's doing it. But you can tell it definitely doesn't sound right. Um, yeah. So, by pressing this button, I'll just disconnect the call. Except if you have it flashing, which for some reason, nothing, with the exception of uh, disconnecting the power from the battery as well as the telephone line, will not disconnect it. So, I try to stay avoid, away from doing that. So, now what we're going to do is I'm going to run the telephone into the closet, and I'm going to have the camera out here, and I'm going to demonstrate uh, simulating a call. All right. Alright, the phone is booting up in here, and I do kind of have to snake everything together. As you can see, I do have it running here, because I don't have a cable long enough, and that, by the way, is the power of Ethernet adapter. And right here is the phone, so, you could try while the phone is ready. Alright.
can hear it, but my cup is working. Alright, here we go. Help me, help me. I am, uh, I'm stuck in the elevator. Help me, help me. Hand to get me out. And there, that's really close to the microphone. And, uh, that's, that's kind of far, kind of back from the microphone. The microphone sounds quite a bit better than the speaker does, doesn't it? All right, so that's just going to about round up this video. Thank you very much for watching, and that'll be it.